when the higher power chooses you, it doesn't hand you a manual. It gives you clues, signs, and whispers. Don't dismiss signs as mere coincidences. Acknowledge them and delve into their depths, and you might discover their arrows pointing you toward your destiny. Here are the signs you are a chosen one. Authenticity. You're not fake. You can't pretend to be something you're not. If something doesn't feel right to you, you'd rather leave the situation than fake your way through it. Being dishonest just isn't in your nature. It feels wrong to you. You also don't get along well with people who aren't genuine, whether they're focused only on material things, love to gossip, or are bullies. You just can't connect with them. You also have a special sense for detecting when someone is being fake. This ability to spot insincerity from a distance is like a natural gift. You have it. It's one of the things that sets you apart as a chosen one. You're not just true to yourself. You also have a knack for recognizing when others are or aren't being true as well. Thirst for more. You're not the kind of person who's happy just going through the motions of everyday life. While some people find comfort in regular routines, you always feel like there's something more, something bigger out there for you. The idea of just fitting in and doing what everyone else does feels like a trap you don't want to fall into. You understand that there's more to life than just a regular job and following society's rules. You're not held back by the limitations that seem to keep others stuck in one place. You know, there's a big, amazing world out there to discover a world that's far beyond just being average. Like the poet Robert Frost said, you're choosing to take the road less traveled, a path that's different from what most people choose. And you know that this choice will shape your life in ways that are truly special, facing challenges. You're going through so much. Many are called, but only a few are chosen. The ones that are chosen are the strongest. They are tough and face the hardest battles. As a chosen one, your life is meant to be filled with challenges right from the beginning. These difficulties serve a purpose. They make you stronger and wiser. When you navigate through dark and hard times, you gain the skills and understanding to guide others who are going through their own struggles. Your experiences equip you to be a beacon for those who are lost or in pain. In a way, the hardships you endure can prevent many others from having to experience the same pain and heartache. By confronting and overcoming your challenges, you make the path easier for those who come after you. Each difficult moment in your life, every pain, every struggle, every test, and every challenge has a reason behind it. Nothing is wasted. Um, these experiences are there to help you grow spiritually and to give you the wisdom you need to make the world a better place. Even when you're going through your own tough times, you somehow find the strength to help others with their struggles. You may not always realize it, but you're acting as a savior and healer for them. You're not just taking care of yourself. You're also a servant and, and a helper, making life better for the people around you. Quest for truth. Ever since you were young, you've been someone who really wants to know the truth. You're not afraid to question the way things are or challenge what everyone else believes. While other people might just go along with what they're told, you'd rather listen to your own heart and make your own way. You're always asking questions and looking for deeper meaning in life. You're driven by this deep curiosity to explore and understand the mysteries of existence, and you know that the real answers aren't always out there in the world. Often, they're inside you, like the philosopher Socrates said. An unexamined life is not worth living. You really believe that. So you're on a quest, a journey to explore yourself and understand who you are. You're not just living life. You're really digging deep to understand it and yourself. Being the black sheep, being the black sheep in your family is another clue that you're a chosen one. You've always felt different, like you don't really belong. You might even have wondered if you were adopted because of how unlike your family you are. When they all go one way, you go the other. Maybe your political beliefs are different or you just see the world in a unique way that they don't understand. Feeling so different can sometimes make you feel lonely or cut off from your family. It's like you're marching to the beat of a different drum and no one else hears the music you're playing. It can be hard feeling like you're in a world of your own while surrounded by people who should feel like home. But it's also a sign that you're meant for something different, something bigger than just fitting in with everyone else, a pure heart. You're a good person. Despite having been treated badly or taken advantage of uh, in the past, you still choose to be kind and, you know, good things for other people. That's because you have a really pure heart, and it's a big reason why you're a chosen one. You're the type who naturally wants to make people happy, sometimes even letting them take more from you than they should. It's not because you're weak. It's because you genuinely love to help. 
Helping others is just part of who you are. It's in your DNA. Some people might think they're taking advantage of you, but you allow it to happen because you're a natural giver. You feel most alive and most yourself when you're giving to others, even if you don't get much back in return. This giving nature of yours is a clear sign that you're someone special, someone chosen for a bigger purpose. Inner knowing. You have an inner knowing. You can try to ignore it all you want <laughs> deep down. You know, you're chosen. It's like a gut feeling. You can't shake a fire in your soul that keeps telling you you're here for something big. You just know you're meant to make a difference in the world. You feel like an old soul, like you've been around longer than your years. The way things work on earth, people bossing each other around, all the hate and fighting, it just doesn't make sense to you. Sometimes you even feel like you belong to a different place, somewhere far from here, and you find yourself missing that unknown home. The feeling is strong. You're not like everyone else, and you're not here just to go along with the flow. You're here to change things, to make the world better. And no matter how much you might try to deny it, that calling won't go away. Disliked by some. People dislike you sometimes, even though you haven't done anything wrong. This can be really confusing, especially because you're a good person. The reason for this is that the goodness in you, the light inside you, makes some people uncomfortable. It's like your light highlights the darkness in them. The parts they aren't proud of as you grow spiritually, that inner light of yours will shine even brighter. While many people will love you for it, some might react strangely or even negatively. It's important to know that this isn't really about you. It's about them and their own issues. So don't let anyone dim your light. Keep being the amazing person you are and let go of the negativity. Trust that the universe has your back and remember that you're guided and protected from above. Don't worry about the people who don't get you. Just keep shining because you're here for a greater purpose, belief in a higher power. Unlike some people who might disrespect spiritual ideas, you deeply respect the powers of the universe or God. You see things that others might miss. You understand that everything is unfolding just as it should, according to a higher plan. You're what's known as a light worker, someone whose job it is to bring light and love into the world. Deep down, you know this is your true calling. Because of this important mission you've been given, you're guided and protected by higher powers. You don't have to be afraid of anything because you're on a path that's been laid out, especially for you and you're not walking it alone. So my friends, if you see these signs that we've discussed, you should listen to the call. It is a sign from a higher power urging you to fulfill a mission while you're living on this earth. If you're still reading, you are part of the faithful family of life as world. Because of you, I can create more videos and offer insightful wisdom. Thank you for being a part of this family. I wish you a prosperous life and may you receive wonderful blessings today.